So if you haven't seen Gertie's reveal, let me know what you guys think. If you have seen it, she looks so much fun to play. I'm just going to make this short and sweet. And now, just finding this out, this a little bit, some extra details. It made me want to talk about it today anyway, just to get some opinions. But what do you guys think is going to happen to Arnold now? Considering the fact, if you have not heard this, Nickelodeon, just take this in. Nickelodeon pushed for Grandma Gertie to get into the game as one of the new characters and newer fighters to represent Hey Arnold. So just thinking about it now, we got Gertie revealed today. I'm glad she got finally revealed so everybody could see how she plays. She looks so much fun to play. I definitely hope she's locked so that way I could be able to unlock her and then just earning the characters that way instead of just having them all playable right then and there. But, um, Gertie and Gerald are the two new reps for Hey Arnold. And I'm thinking, I'm, I'm just going to say it here. I'm thinking Arnold has a, doesn't stand a chance of getting into the game any now and just going forward into the future for the game. I don't think he's going to be DLC now, considering the fact that Nickelodeon pushed for Gertie. So I think that destroys his chances of getting in on the roster. I think that shatters it. And coming out and finding this out now, I just want to let you guys know. Cause some people might be a little bit curious how come gertie got pit nickelodeon wanted her to get into the game and then i just want to read this part of this little article that i found out you know that i found today and it just even just tells you a little bit about the character it says given her age grandma grandma gertie might seem like an unusual addition to the roster but the character was shown to be very capable in the animated series in fact gertie was a black belt and her official description states that karate moves will be front and center when she appears in Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2. So that, just reading that part stood out to me and they could see the potential in Gertie being a real fighter. See what I'm saying? So I wanted to make that point today. Gertie, they saw, they must, Nickelodeon must have viewed Gertie as a, as a real fighter in comparison to Arnold, even though he is the main character in the show. I want him in the game too. But I think this now definitely destroys his chances of probably being added as DLC because they see a bigger potential and a capability as a fighter potential at Gertie and seeing the fight within her from the show as evidence. And then she's the same character who taught Arnold how to fight in the little martial arts episode. Anybody remember that episode? Arnold's just going crazy on anybody that was just went near him. He was just ruthless. So I hope I was hoping that they would probably add him, but they probably see him as a fit for Nickelodeon racing or car racing, unfortunately. So that's what I'm thinking now. That's the vibe I get now since Nickelodeon pushed for Grandma Gertie and then they made changes to have Helga in the background, but we don't know if she's still gonna be playable. And we still have a big mystery with Leonardo and Mikey with Nickelodeon having having an input on some of these characters, I don't think they would probably get rid of Leonardo and Mikey. And then some of these other recent characters like Lincoln. Let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think Arnold still has a chance of getting into Nickelodeon All Star Brawl 2? For me, I don't think that's probably gonna happen. And knowing that fact that they actually wanted Gertie into the game and being implemented as a new rep to get into the game as a fighter. I think that definitely changes his fate and his chances of getting in 